Some call it an art of God, while others denounced it as an insult to humanity. But regardless of the opinions one would have, each of these exhibits tell a story that everyone shares, the story of our body. After traveling across various cities in the U.S., the Body Worlds 3 exhibit has finally arrived to Phoenix and will be available to the general public at the Arizona Science Center until May. Most of the visitors to Body Worlds agree that the exhibition is tasteful and awe-inspiring. I thought it was very nice, very well done, very well put together, very, uh, very uh, interesting science. Some of the visitors also left the exhibition with a valuable lesson in health and wellness. Um, yeah, I wish um, more people would pay attention to the lung cancer section and because uh, that's what I've got and uh, it's not fun. The Body Worlds franchise was developed by German anatomist Gunther von Hagens. There are three exhibits in total and together they have drawn more than 20 million people across dozens of cities worldwide. The exhibits left Germany for good in 2004 due to years of moral outrage in Germany. It has since been shown mainly in the U.S. and Canada. ASU psychology professor Adam Cohen says that the controversy surrounding the exhibit is due in part to the society's fear of death. I think there's a lot of ambivalence about how we feel about death and dead bodies in our culture. I think on the one hand, you know, some beliefs like, you know, belief in heaven and belief in the afterlife are very common among Americans. But on the other hand, we, we live in a culture that, um, you know, we, we, we hide death a lot from ourselves. We have a lot of expressions, you know. For example, you know, we don't say, you know, we don't say something like, you know, when did your uncle die? You know, we say, when did your uncle pass away? We have these expressions that even keep us from thinking about death too directly. Um, and so I think there's a lot of desire to keep death far away from us. It's something that's scary and frightening as well. Most of the visitors, however, didn't agree with the moral outrage and thinks people should at least give the exhibits a chance. Not at all. Um, I didn't see anything that was offensive in there. The human body is a human body. If uh, you take kids that are questioning, I mean, you'd be prepared. After crossing dozens of cities around the world, the Body Worlds exhibit is still teaching everyone the story of life, one body at a time. Reporting from the Arizona Science Center in downtown Phoenix, this is Kenneth Wong reporting.